Praise Master Jesus. Praise Master Jesus. God is a good God. That is awesome, God. Yes, is. We have question and answer. Yes. Let's get into this. Yes. Name Gina. My name is Gina Jr. I have been experiencing a lot of harassment at work, and I just received an unfair 2021 performance rating. Should I complain to my director, who is also colliding, colluding, and to human resources, or should I accept this injustice without complaining? The rating was meets expectations, when it should have been above expectations. What does God direct me to do? If my God says I must make this sacrifice more because a lot will change for the better soon, I accept and sign this unfair classification. I do not use Facebook, only YouTube. May God continue blessings you greatly in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. To wow. God. Thank you. Uh mm -hmm. That was a that was a that was a great one. That was a good one too. Yeah. Good question and uh, yeah. advice. And uh, this is one thing I believe. Mm -hmm. Most times, this process builds us up. Yeah. These attacks in our job, in our home or friendship, it builds us up. You know, at least you know yourself that you're doing a great job out there you know yourself you can uh, prove to yourself or you can speak for yourself and this made me to remember when i, I first started driving a big truck my the first company i was with you know i was there for maybe three months and i begin to be so upset because of the way they they treating me you know he right. was treating me so bad the owner and uh I was getting frustrated, you know, nothing that I do out there makes them happy. So mm -hmm. um, I was expecting to get raised and things was, you know, it was horrible. Then I made up my mind that I'm going to quit that job. Yeah. You know, uh, I begin to ask question to my uh, one of my uncle. I was like, man, this is what I'm going through. What do you think? He said, uh, he don't know, you know, but uh, he will advise me to stay. You know, he, he will advise me to stay. I said, okay. Uh, but at the same time, I was getting more frustrated mm -hmm. until God spoke to me. I was doing something at work. God spoke to me that you are going to be here for a year and six months. Man, I was talking about under three months. God was speaking that I will be here a year and six months. I yeah. was like, wow. He's just ready to go. <laughs> I was so ready to go. Yeah. And not knowing that God want to use those, uh, 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 whatsoever that was going on at that time, just to build me up, just to train to me. Train you. And to God be the glory. And you all know that I, I stayed in that company exactly a year and six months. <laughs> And it was an open door for me to leave at that time. Boom. And I left. And mm -hmm. the experience and all that helped me out to get to this level yeah. that I am in as a truck driver. So my advice to you is to keep on enduring this. Keep on enduring this. God sees everything, knows everything. Mm -hmm. But if you want to, if you are really tired of this, God is not going to be upset with you for quitting this job. Yeah. If you want to quit, make sure that mm -hmm. you have another place that they have hired you yes. or they have promised you 100% that they will hire you. Mm -hmm. Then you can quit. Mm -hmm. That's my advice. I think you did the great, great advice. Exactly. I totally agree with my husband. If you have an open door to go to another job, I would definitely do that in the time that you see fit. Because, <laughs> yeah. you know, um, we know that uh, money can be an issue. Yeah. They need to, you need to be worth um, more. Yeah, at the other job. You don't need to go, you don't need to lower yourself. Yeah. So I will look at, get into the money. But uh, um, I will tell you this, because I, I did see the word harassment yeah. on that letter. And as for me, this is 
what I would personally do. Um, I believe in he, human resources in a minute. I believe that when someone is harassing you at work, um, I would definitely use paperwork mm. to deal with the situation because if something, you know, uh, happens in the future concerning this issue with them two, uh, colluding, um, it's in paperwork yeah. and they can't say that you lied because you have reported it and reported yeah. it. Anytime you feel harassed, I will report it every single time. Yeah. Um, you don't need to, you know what the Bible says, don't let your left hand know what your right hand is doing. Anything that you do, do it in, um, do it in a way you're not um, expressing everybody in the whole company. Yeah, I, yeah. I went to HR here. I wrote, you know, yeah. uh, wrote against them. No, keep it secret. Yeah. Do it. Uh, do it that way. And um, um, eventually, I guess if you if they feel like you keep getting harassed, they will do a secret meeting with with you and probably with them. Um, all companies are different, yeah. but I would definitely go to their meeting. I would uh, tell them how I feel. Be nice and be very smart and have wisdom on how you have conversations. Yeah. You know, do it with uh, respect and uh, let them so, sh uh, let them see your concern. I, I definitely agree with human human resources. Yeah. Um, and um, what I was going to say, um, I would like to know more information, but I know I can't right now. But I would love to know is like uh, when you did get the review. Um, did you get a raise with this review or, you know, or you didn't get a raise? Um, I don't know. I don't know why. What I would like to know about that. But yeah, because the, the, the whole thing mm -hmm. will give you the strength, you know, yeah. to keep on moving forward. Uh, then if you're not getting raised, you know, they're not paying you the way they're supposed to pay you. you yeah. know, that stuff will still make you more weak, you know, um, the whole thing. Uh, yeah, because on the thing it said she met expectations. So to me, you still got a good review. Okay, so the other one was like, I forgot which what uh, I, I know the first one was like the best, and that's what you wanted, right? So I was just like, they, it is great. I know you deserve more, but I was just like, are you? Did you not get the raise that you wanted? And uh, because you know, because I'm like, that's the only thing that will matter for me, yeah. you know, but yeah. um, I would also, if you really just want to nip it in the bud, I would definitely, you know, say, hey, boss, or if this, if that's your boss, obviously, I'll be like, hey, can we go in the office and talk? Yeah. What am I not doing? You know, yeah. what am I doing wrong? What am I doing wrong in your eyes? Yeah. You know, I need to, because I want more, because I've, I, look, we have five children. Um, Some kids like A, B, they like making A-Bs. Uh, one child like to make A's. And when that one child that love to make A's, they really break down if they make a B. And so uh, they 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 want to know, what did I do wrong yeah. to make this B? So that's basically what you're saying. I would definitely, you know, oh, ask yeah. them, hey, you know, what am I doing wrong so that I could do better? I yeah. want to do better. I mean, I don't think they will get mad at you about that. They would yeah. be like, wow, this person really care about their job yeah. performance. Yeah. I, I think, yeah, yeah, yeah I, I, you should do that. Mm -hmm. And uh, I, I wish I, I wish I was uh, brave enough to really like confront my boss that early stage. But I left that. I didn't even talk to him That's true. until the period of time that I wanted to leave. Man. Yeah. I, okay. I was, Everything I'm saying, it depends on how long you've been there. It no, depends on. No, no, oh. no. What I'm saying uh, is, everywhere can be different. That's true. You know, like me, I would take my time forever before confronting them. But oh, yeah. somebody, like if you would have been. It, 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 I think it would have been greater for me if I would have confronted him at that time, yeah. you know, called him, hey, I don't like what's going on. Yeah. How can we fix this? I, I, yeah. It would have been more better than me holding it all. Oh, oh, yeah. You know, I think I believe that uh, it will it will be more great if this person will go to the the boss and be like, hey, yes, what am I doing wrong? Period, period. Because, because that's, that my per help. that's my personality. And I even did yeah. a video about it when I had the pink hat on. Yeah. And I was just like, you need to, whatever, that how you feel, you need to confront the person. Yeah. And I even put in even your boss. Yeah. Because um, I used to be a boss myself. I had people that were under me. 
And not only did I have people under me, I had bosses above me. And when I had an issue with them or if I felt like they were trying to embarrass me, oh, no, no, no. We're going to have a conversation because you know why? We are adults. I don't care if you're making more money than me. I am an adult and you're going to treat me like an adult and we're going to both respect one another and we need to nip this in a bud. Adult yeah. people should have conversations. And, uh, yeah. you know, yeah, I, I really think it's, it's good to have conversations. Yeah. Have wisdom on it, though. Yes. Have wisdom on it. Yes. You know, so, and, and make sure you leave with good on the good terms. Yes. Don't um, leave with more fight, you know, try to have an understanding at the end. Yeah, don't leave <laughs> yeah. why you don't have anywhere to go because yeah. you don't want to be broke. Yeah. <sighs> but I'm going to repeat myself. If it's to the point that you feel like you can't have that one on one conversation, yeah. adult conversation, yeah. yeah, you need to go to HR. Let HR try to fix this. If HR can't fix this, I would definitely, yeah, have uh, go to another job. Yeah. Be treated like a queen, as you yes. should. Amen. Listen. You, you never know, man. <laughs> you never know. All right. So, you know, this is open conversation. If anybody have an opinion on this, do it. Please do it nicely and do it with respect, everyone. Yeah. Listen, if you haven't subscribed to Henry and Monique, go ahead and do so. You know why? Because it will automatically make, make you a good, good Christian. Christian. Because Cook Christians, we, we hang out over, over here. here. God bless you all. We love you guys. Bye, y'all. Yeah, I did that with the highest pitch ever, didn't I? <laughs> I was a soprano. All right, bye, y'all. Bye, you